Portrait of a Lady on Fire is a French film directed by Camilla Schiama. I had no interest in this film, but my friend really wanted to go. Also, this uh, movie apparently won the second um, prize at the Cannes Film Festival. That's what I'm told. Uh, this movie is about Marianne. She is a painter who arrives uh, on, on a boat, goes to this uh, sort of uh, rich, not, not necessarily rich person's house, but a, a house, and she is commissioned to paint a portrait of the young woman there. The young woman is uh, Heloise, and she has already been through many painters because she doesn't want her portrait painted because the portrait will be sent to her fiancé in Milan. So this movie is a small sort of drama romance film. It is, be, it is about the forbidden romance between Marianne and Heloise. There's also a nice little um, friendship with the maid Sophie, who ends up being like their ally. This movie is really slow though. Now granted, I didn't know anything about this movie, but I used the hot tub earlier and I went for a massage, so I was really tired and like, you know, this is Vancouver International Film Festival, so like the theater was packed and it was really warm in there, so I fell asleep. Um, for maybe, I don't know, 10 minutes, and that was probably the most crucial part of the movie, which sucks, because it has to do with the ending. But um, the parts that I was, that was the only time I fell asleep during the movie. The movie's two hours, I only fell asleep near the beginning. Um, however, when I woke up, uh, the sort of started to ramp up the romance aspect. It's a very slow burn drama film. It isn't like, you know... They become lovers immediately after meeting, and it's really slow. And however, the second half is definitely better paced, and more things happen. I really like the small thematic touches using a story that they're reading. Um, I also like the Sophie, the subplot, and everything. And the the movie does have a pretty good ending as well. It was a, uh, it definitely wasn't you know like um, anything original or new, but it's uh, it had a lot of emotion, really good acting. Uh, searing romance and um, a lot of good artistic touches and just didn't necessarily wow me. So I give uh, Portrait of a Lady on Fire a six and a half out of ten.